Okay, complete the story uh, which starts with once upon a time, a boy found a wallet under a tree. Okay, uh, here is answers for you also. Complete, sometimes you may be asked uh, the questions like that. Complete the story which starts with once upon a time, a boy found a wallet under a tree. And for that, you are going to give the title in your school label also you studied about how to develop a story uh, in that label you would be given clues but in class 11 you are not given any clues in your higher studies you are not given any clues okay this question is equally important for the students of SCE class 11 12 and all levels okay here you can have a screenshot it's for necessity if you are interested, you can have a screenshot and I'm going to comprehend the story I have written here, which starts with once upon a time, a boy found a wallet under a tree that is a five marks, five marks question. Okay, once upon a time there lived a boy named Harry in the village called Corona. Yes, this is the name of the village, very uh, current, that is a current issue global pandemic uh, that is coronavirus it's affecting all the communities of the world that's why the communities are better called corona communities okay there is a place called corona who had possessed the degree of honesty you are asked to write uh, a story in the past tense if you want to make the story live you are using present tense but that present tense should be what uh, demarcated within double inverted comma Okay, that is the train you might have been uh, given, you might have been taught in your previous levels by your respective teachers. Okay, uh, there is a boy, there was a boy, that's past tense, uh, his name was Shari. Uh, he was living, he lived in the place called Corona, what possessed the degree of honesty in the locality because the title of the story is the boy of honesty or honest boy, locality. On such occasion appeared in his life to display his loyalty and honesty to a man of another village. He was very popularized with a man of honesty in his village. But another such occasion came in the life of the boy to display his honesty in another village. That's why he was not limited uh, there in his only village called Corona. He was also equally important. He was equally recognized or popularized in other places too. Uh, one day while he was going through the blubbered path, blubbered path means a line marked with trees. Okay, the road marked with trees, that is a blubbered path. He happened to find a wallet under one of the trees at the roadside. Okay, he happened to find a wallet, uh, that is money wallet and under a tree, under a, one of the trees at the roadside because he was going across the bulbard path he held that uh, wallet up he picked up the wallet up and observed the documents inside uh, the wallet okay there were some documents including money and visiting card which prompted him to know the amount of money and the details of the respective owner who was the owner whose purse whose wallet was that or who did that wallet belong to he came to know the informations from the document inside the wallet he suspected and i have cite what i have written here in present tense with the double inverted comma yes the list story is becoming live now okay if you want to make the story live you can use present tense but it should be in double inverted comma Perhaps that man dropped that wallet shedding under the tree. Whenever he was taking a shelter, okay, uh, what uh, under the tree uh, to be uh, safe from scorching sunlight, he might have been taking shed, he might have been taking shelter under the tree at the time the wallet accidentally uh, dropped down. He might have uh, in great shock after he lost his wallet that person might have been great soft. He was speculating, the boy was speculating like that. And instead of going to uh, my destinations, 
I should submit the wallet first. How honest the person was. He did not like to focus on his destination. He was giving priority to submit the what uh, submit the wallet to the respective owner before he reached his destination. I should submit the wallet first. Yes, uh, here I'm going to follow the uh, what uh, visiting card of this person. So that person uh, is going to follow the what uh, visiting card of that person on the basis of visiting card he could reach the house of the respective owner and he could submit the wallet which was dropped by the man which was dropped by the owner and found by the boy of anesty okay the student in such a way can write the story being self-instructed by the visiting card of the owner the boy reached his house the boy reached the house of the owner being instructed self-instructed by the visiting card there was nobody to instruct him to show the locations to show the house of the owner the visiting card itself instructed the man instructed the boy to reach what the man's house then he gave the wallet found by him the owner to the what look at that the owner who had no bound on the other hand the owner uh, did not have any bound of joy and compliments he gave to the boy being contented by the honesty of the boy the owner gave all the money inside the wallet to the boy as a reward okay look at that his honesty was rewarded later on uh, he had got huge amount of money inside the wallet but the boy uh, but the man did not pay attention towards the money he gave that money amount of money to the boy is the reward from that particular day the boy was able to earn additional fame in the public wherever he went he was looked with the eyes of veneration and you he got graced everywhere all the people graced him everywhere uh, because of the honesty he displayed in each and every activity that's why he prioritized honesty this exposure of honesty and you can you cannot cannot write moral uh, in this level uh, moral is not necessary provided that you are studying you are answering these questions to uh, ase examination you, moral is almost inevitable should be written but here uh, that is up to you you can write or cannot write you may write or you may not write the moral honesty is the best policy exposure of honesty leads one to be rewarded this is the way you can write the answer in your examination there is student this is all about uh, the story uh, development story in your uh, previous level also you might have studied about such what uh, what that call a story development type i would like to uh, stop the screen or i would like to give you another questions here uh similarly okay dear student another one write a paragraph on the misuse of mobile phone okay this can be also asked for five minutes if you are writing one paragraph you are not going to change the paragraph here an instruction is given to you misuse of mobile phone okay in the pre story era people had to undergo a series of inscrutabilities series of difficulties associated to their everyday life they their life was full of difficulties in the pre story era that means during the hunting gathering age people did not have any means of communication in this way you are going to bring the context for mobile phone the life was absent from the means of communications they were discarded they were put a very avoided from the means of communication they did not have any access of means of communications physical mobility itself was the only alternative for communication if they want to receive the messages if, if they want to wanted to deliver the messages and receive the messages they had to walk on foot for long distance that's why physical mobility itself was the only alternative for communications in the past in the prehistoric era along with the passage of time various technologies have been developed invention of mobile phone is one of the such great achievements emerged in the field of communication which is expected to reduce various problems associated to people mobility and communications okay at present we have got mobile phone 
and this mobile phone is the one of the greatest achievements in the field of science and technology in the field of communication and along with the invention of mobile phone people are expected to reduce various problems associated to people's mobility that means people don't have to move from one place to another place they don't have to move from one geographical location to another geographical location to communicate or to deliver the message and receive the message nevertheless it cannot be excluded from being misused by the users okay you are now connecting the misuse of mobile phone how you are uh, writing the misuse of mobile phone nevertheless it cannot be excluded from being misused by the users it has its dark side too prompting the loss of humanity what are the misuse of mobile phone what are the effects of misuse of mobile phone okay people are losing humanity morality and erasure of peace peace is being erasured peace is being put uh, interfered at the presence of misuse of mobile phone okay dear student if you are writing a paragraph you are not going to change the paragraph don't change the paragraph here okay if you are writing a couple of paragraph you are changing the paragraph so you have to go according to the questions you have to answer according to the questions you have to be instructed according to the questions if the question asks you to write a couple of paragraph you are changing the paragraph if you are asked to write all paragraph here you are not going to change the paragraph continue don't change the paragraph here on another slide i'm going to present but you are not going to change the paragraph creative and energetic abilities of the student can be impaired because of the regular use of mobile phone this is this is the first misuse of mobile phone in the life of the students okay this is very uh, current very control uh, very much uh, uh, effective questions very much possible questions from the point of view of examination because nowadays the uh, students are asked to participate in online classes and at the time of uh, participating in online classes the teachers and the guardians they are encouraging them to use mobile phone but instead of using mobile phone there can be the chance of misuse of mobile phone by the students if they that is regularly used while surfing internet the people can involve in criminal activities since materials available in the internet give them way to involve in such activities that is another misuse of mobile phone the student can be the people can be acquainted with various what ways to involve in the criminal activities okay this uh, use of mobile this misuse of mobile phone helps them to involve in the criminal activities because they get the materials needed to involve in such activities similarly mobile phone can be misused by the student in examination period damaging their creative potentialities during examination what happens if they are instead of preparing in, instead of involving in preparation if they are found involving in mobile phone using mobile phone what happens their creative potentiality can be damaged their rational potentiality can be damaged in the similar manner it can be misused while it's scrolling facebook youtube and other social networking system when people are scrolling facebook the uh, youtube and other networking system mobile phone can be also misused they tend to learn uh, data hacking on their regular use of mobile phone involving in unnecessary gossip unnecessary talk discourse unnecessary social unnecessary discourse chatting is the waste of time in the life of the people especially students in this regard people are expected to make the wise and ethical use of mobile phone to get its utmost fruitfulness okay these things you are going to write down when you are writing the misuse of mobile phone okay dear student i have done two questions today one this is misuse of mobile phone and another one writing the story okay how to write the story uh,